Say good morning, baby. She got a party hat on. Want some water? Miss Violet got shots. So we're getting Starbucks. <laughs> Only makes sense. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. You're too old. She was literally awake a minute ago and now she's out for the count. Hey Jackson! I'm taking a video. You're so cute. It's Dom's last day of kindergarten. I'm taking a video. First grader in town. Dad, I actually was going to be at dinner. <laughs> and here's Mr. Nicholas, our newest nephew in the bunch. That was better. So I just had to clean that off because Jackson, um, I was taking all of that footage earlier. Like today movies? Yeah. I don't think you need them because it's not supposed to rain, but after. I had a great time visiting my nephews this morning. Um, it was Dominic's last day of kindergarten, so that was cool to be there on his last day. It was so sweet that he was sad to be done with kindergarten. Um, but now I'm back home. Um, I edited the vlog. Peter's on a conference call. He's still probably work until four last yesterday he worked a little bit later though um tonight is mine and my grandma's birthday dinner and dessert with our immediate family um so i'm in charge of making our red sauce we're gonna have that and ravioli salad and bread and then cherry pie for dessert <laughs> I'm gonna show him how disheveled Peter looks. <laughs> He's in his jammies still. Hi. You ready to be happy again? Oh. I've been slaving away like a dog all day at work. I think I worked like 12 hours today, but I have a big project due by the end of the month. Grant's gone, he really is skateboarding. Grant was like, I'm, I was gonna go outside with Violet because I need to. I need some outside time because I've been stuck up. She's not okay. She's making me feel good. I bet I can skateboard better with, than you with bare feet. You can. What are you going to say with the baby in your hand? I'm like, no, you can't. No, I would do many things that would irk Christina while holding her child, but I would not skateboard. <laughs> like I'm about to go in the hammock. Okay, so me and Christina are doing front walkovers. Grant is gonna try. So the momentum helps you. That was not a running start. Grant could do one handed. Can you, can you do, do, do an it? extra glimpse into my life? Fifth grade. <laughs> I wish I still had the footage. Fifth grade. I used to be able to do a no handed cartwheel. It's called an aerial. Fifth grade Good challenge. Did you know? Fifth grade talent show. So nervous. Me and Jenna Mahoney. Shout out. I love your hat. <laughs> <laughs> and I fell, and I'm traumatized ever since. This is. This she is literally cool. just like <laughs> fell on her. <laughs> and I actually was like a vlogger because I had it on. I had it on film. The big show. <laughs> okay. Show my front walkover. <laughs> Five, six, and seven, eight, go one, two, go three, four, five. <laughs> That's how someone should propose. <laughs> you can do it. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five. Whoa! Christina was a cheerleader recently. <laughs> Before I had a baby. Peter used to be a skater. First row of skating, wear shoes. First, second row of skating. There ain't no rules. <laughs> ah! Did you almost bust your toe? I almost busted my ankle. <laughs> Third rule. <laughs> Never stop trying.
Was that good? No. <laughs> Looks good to me. No way. Is that bait? Go like this. No. You need oil for you. We had our naked baby, and now we're gonna have a cherry pie. Jenna's here. <laughs> we're celebrating Grandma's 83. Pink. Pink. Yellow. I knew it. She's so sad because she had her shots today. <laughs> Hey, 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 Oh boy, I can't believe it's already this late again. It's like 8.30. Got a cup of coffee. Made some of that um, Mary Lou's. But I decided since I haven't had the chance to come out and actually enjoy the hammock that I put together, I'm gonna, I'm gonna relax on it for a little bit. Sarah had Violet sleeping on her, so she might pass her off in a minute or two and come out, she said, and hang out with me on the hammock because this is actually Sarah's hammock. We just didn't bring it with us because we're renting an apartment. And I don't know if we'll take this one or if we'll just get a new one when we have a yard of our own. But this is actually Sarah. She got it for her birthday like three years ago or four years ago. It is hours later. Well, I have a clip of you guys on the guitar. Okay, so it's <laughs> minutes after that, but hours from the previous. Clip. So the building I just showed you, that is our junior high school, and that's where we first started to have classes together. We met when we were very young, but we really <laughs> like we like start began had every our, class. our relationship, yeah. our friendship there. Yes. So we're walking home from Peter's Brothers. We just had a fun night on their porch. We brought the guitar, played a bunch of little music. And now we're just walking down the street. It's funny because like I feel like last time I did this amount of walking in Evergreen Park, I was like 14. But oh. now that we walk like anywhere from five to ten miles a day in the theme parks, we don't have a car here. Right. Everyone's well, asleep because it's almost one in the morning. So we're just walking. I was like, you can just walk back. It's only We've a We've definitely mile and a half. walked this after we were 14 because we basically walked like Peter's brother lives where Peter's family's house used to be and we're walking to my house so we usually would leave we would meet in the middle at like a park in that direction but yeah. we've done this trip but we're about to times. walk past prime <laughs> early Sarah and Peter relationship history about to walk past the subway that I used to work at for three years four years Decent amount of time, even after the college program, after yeah, he worked I at I remember Disney. texting Dom, like, sitting oh, there's on a... like a new place. What? Brow art. Oh, that w that place at the end was always like a revolving door of businesses. Okay. So here's our, our neighborhood Dunkin' Donuts. And here's our neighborhood Subway. I guarantee you if I shattered that window, oh the, the door, and walked in there, that the combination to the security code is the exact same. And I could probably deactivate it. Yeah? Yeah. And this King's Walk Chinese food is killer. And it's been here for like 15 years. Yeah, this, the one next to it always is like rotating out. Can't keep up its business, but 
King's Walk. Is curfew a thing? Like, are we breaking curfew? I don't know. We're 26 years old. I think. I don't IDs on us. Like, who knows? I don't know. We'll see. We only have like another like third of a mile left. We're home. We made it. We didn't get pulled over by the cops. We didn't get tickets for being out past curfew. We got some a sour patch kids. Guys, if we were to home vlog, even a year and a half ago, two years, to be honest, three years ago, before we were married, this is what you would see like 90% of the time. It's just us two sitting on the couch like this with something like the office on. And that would be the vlog. So that's what we're doing. We're gonna finish the night. It is like two in the morning. But gonna... we like it's oh not that it's okay. Like it's one thing when like you don't sleep in your own home. Then when like there's other people sleeping and they like go to bed with intentions to like just go, go to, to bed. And it's a little weird, but we just We're on vacation. I'm done with work until Tuesday, so like I feel like even though we've been here for two and a half days. I feel like my vacation's just beginning, like, today. Because, mm -hmm. like, I thought I was getting out, out of, like, work. Like, I was thought I was going to log offline at, like, 3 p.m. Or 2 p.m. Yeah. I thought I was getting off at 2 p.m. Because, like, it's a weekend holiday and usually they let us sign off early. Um, I didn't get off line until Chicago time, like, 6.30, which is, like, 7.30, my normal office time. So, like, I was working Feels late. It's nice to be on. Feels nice to be off knowing that I don't have to touch my computer or an email until Tuesday and nobody else I work with will either. Yeah. So it's really going to be like, now the fun night. begins. We had a good I, night. I didn't show any of the dinner, but we had raviolis mm -hmm. and it was really good. The sauce turned out great. I forgot to tell you guys, I didn't have to get anything removed off of mm -hmm. myself after the dermatologist. So that's always good that my skin looks good. Um, so that was all good news. Um, we had a great night with Peter's brother and our sister-in-law. Mm -hmm. um, the kids were all asleep, so we're going to show you them some okay. point between now and when we leave. Like we're going to yeah. stop by either tomorrow or the, the next couple of days to see them, but they were all asleep, which is good. Um, but it was a good night. We even just like hung out with them and just chit-chatted and listened to some music in a long time. Mm -hmm. It's weird that we walked home from them because like before we moved to Florida, that would feel like a long walk. Mm -hmm. But now we walk so much in the park yeah, that I was like, let's just like... walk home. Like We don't have to Uber. Uh -huh. Or have somebody pick us up. Like it's just. It's walk. like from World Showcase to your parking spot. Right. Or, or it's like, like Mexico to Canada, like the long way. Like that was it. Right. And we handled that in like ten minutes. Yeah. So. That's good. But we're gonna watch some Office, eat some Sour Patch Kids, and that'll be the end of the night. So we're not gonna vlog any of that. So. Mm -hmm. Thank you for following along with our Chicago vlogs. We always really appreciate it, especially when we're not in Disney and you follow along with mm -hmm. us. So. And especially when we're not like go, go, and go, and like we haven't been back downtown or to any of the like mm -hmm. action packed stuff. So these have really kind of been Chicago home vlogs. So mm -hmm. even more so appreciative. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.